first thing you want to do, yeah, you know it? You want to say it out loud? No? You want to say it out loud? Yeah, the answer. Yeah, no, just what it is. Classification. The classification is a, a quadratic and a Okay, anybody get a different one? You get the same? Yeah? Yeah. Okay, so let's go and take a look and see what was right. Um, so the first thing we're going to want to do, though, is apply distributive property. If I don't apply distributive property, I'm not going to be able to put this into standard form. So therefore, I have f of x equals 3x squared plus 5x. Negative x times x is a negative x squared. Negative x times negative 4 is a positive 4x. Does everybody agree? Does everybody understand? Well, now I have a couple like terms. These both have the same base of x and the same power of 2. So those are like terms, so I can combine them. These both have the same base x and the same power of 1. So I can combine them. So therefore, when I combine them, I basically have, uh, I can rewrite them right next to each other. 3x squared minus x squared plus 5x plus 4x. You don't have to do this step, but I just want to show you guys when you have like terms, you can simply combine them. And this is what I taught before we did imaginary numbers. 3x squared minus x squared is 2x squared. 5x plus 4x is 9x. Therefore, we can see that the degree is 2, so it's definitely a quadratic. But there is only two terms, so it is a quadratic binomial. Did you make a mistake on your student property? Yeah. And we didn't cover that this class.